this was a very impulsive purchase. Let's open the box up and find out if this was really worth $300. Taken out of the box now, we have the game, the steel case, a wand, some wires, and the book. We got the collector's edition for the PlayStation 5, and here it is. Let's crack it open. Nice. Inside the collector's edition, it comes with some downloadable codes. One for Dark Arch Rose and Onyx Phoenix. Let us know down below in the comments if you played the PlayStation 5 exclusive mission. Next, we got the Steel Book Case. A really nice, kind of like an emerald green. I don't know if the light is showing that off nice, but it is nice looking. Now, probably onto the most expensive one I have ever purchased. This is the Ancient Magic Wand. Look how beautiful this actually really looks in hand. Strangely enough, it has weight to it because of the detail on it, but it also feels hollow, if that makes any sense. I guess that's how they get it to float. But I'm not sure if it's actually plastic or wood. Like, I can't tell. It feels like wood, but I, I'm pretty sure it's plastic. I mean, for the price you pay, it has to be freaking wood. <laughs> now on to the base, which is the book that will help the wand float. Fun fact, I didn't even know it's supposed to float before I even bought the collector's edition. So that was pretty fun. The book looks nice. Oh, the ancient symbol. The book has some heft to it, because it's not small, but it is hollow, and it does smell like plastic. So for all you people who are expecting a real leather-bound book, not spoil getting that. <laughs> you're not getting that. You're getting plastic. Probably the same thing like the wand. You're getting plastic. But it is nice and detailed. You're not going to see any of this detail once it's plugged in. All you're going to see is the open book. So right here is the instructions for the floating wand. And it shows how to do it. And we're going to do it right now and show you guys. So you plug it in at the top of the book, right in the spine. You put this paper down <laughs> right on top of it. Place the wand right where... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hi. <laughs> it's like mag. And then you got to like poop it out. <laughs> Three hundred dollars for nothing. <laughs> so here we go. I figured it out. <laughs> it's finally floating. I assume there's some sort of magnet in the bottom somewhere. For three hundred dollars, was this really worth it? Eh, it depends. <laughs> Just dropped it. The book is beautiful. The wand is beautiful. The game is awesome. The content that you get with it is cool. Yes mainly cosmetic stuff and then one exclusive mission other than that the execution of putting the one on the book is the most infuriating thing Bang i've ever had to deal with <laughs> here's some footage of us just attempting to do it but all in all as a collector i like it because it's gonna look nice on the shelf and as you see i'm a huge harry potter fan so yeah i love that but not 300 dollars worth anyway if you like the video don't forget to like and comment if you love harry potter make sure you subscribe for more videos yeah as always don't, don't forget, forget to, to share, share the magic, magic. bye, bye.